The MMA season on Access TV Fights came to a close with Legacy Fighting Alliance number 56 from Minnesota. Happy holidays, fight fans. I'm Ron Kruk, joined by the Grinch and UFC Hall of Famer Pat Militich. You know I, I, I say that, and it, it's... I want you to be happy when I call you the Grinch. It's okay, but the commercialization of Christmas is what bothers us both, the actual <laughs> Grinch and myself. Oh, my gosh. We don't the have meaning, time for this. The meaning we of Christmas is We don't have important. time for this. That's true. That's true. And as you can see, we are late for a Christmas party, so let's get to the highlights from LFA 56. We begin in the featherweight division. Steve Merrill stepping in on a few days' notice to take on Yusuf Zalal, one of the hot up-and-comers and top prospects in the promotion. Yeah, Merrill getting clipped with that knee shooting in. Look, he knew his chances were going to be on the ground against Zalal. Zalal, a dangerous, dangerous guy, but Zalal, excellent striker, shows he's an excellent grappler, ends up locking up this choke and finishing Merrill. Slick submission for the Factory X product, earning his sixth career victory and in entering into the Access TV Fights rankings. Bobby Lee, we have Marquez Jackson. Bobby Lee coming in in front of the hometown fans, but Jackson was on a mission in this one. Jackson striking is ridiculous, and the guillotine that he got on the wrestler Bobby Lee, talk about tight. Bobby Lee knows he's in trouble. He's trying to get out of there. Not happening. Jackson came into this fight as the number two ranked lightweight. He may have earned himself a title shot with that win against one of these fighters. Would it be undefeated Achilles Moda or would it be Austin Hubbard? The lightweight title on the line and, and Hubbard was in trouble early, Pat. I don't know if he was ever in trouble. He was certainly absorbing a massive amount of punishment, though. Those knees and heavy shots from Achilles Moda, but Moda's gas tank runs out hubbard relying on that altitude training out in colorado turns on the steam for four straight rounds after losing the first round i tell you what austin hubbard proving his medal and that he belongs referee should have stopped this one a lot earlier so it took him quite a while austin hubbard earned that championship a five round war goes to austin hubbard who is your new lfa a lightweight champion last Live event of the year, but we got plenty more MMA action on Access beginning December 14th as we take a look back at the best knockouts of 2018, followed by, you really don't want to miss this, a Christmas quarrel between Pat, Phoenix, and myself. That goes down on December 21st, and then live action returns in the new year from Broomfield, Colorado, January 18th. Happy holidays, everyone.